the Phantom Safety Pin. Welcome back to Let's Free Play Lego Batman. This time around, the, botan the Botanical Garden, not the Botanical Gardens, Phantom. <laughs> Botanical Gardens Villain Mode as Tropical Joker. Um, just like we did in the Hero Mode, I'll be playing as Tropical Joker for this level. Instead of Vanilla Joker. Um, and we have an interesting crew. We have Bob the Goon. Come on, Bob. We have Killer Moth. Killer Croc. A Two-Faced Goon. Huntress. Robin. And a SWAT guy. And Killer Croc. And Two-Faced Goon. And Killer Croc and a Two-Faced Goon and Killer Croc and I don't know what I was doing there. That was fantastic. Just gonna break all these things, make sure we didn't miss anything. Doesn't look like we did. And open up this. I think we might have got. Nope, we didn't get what was in here yet. My bad. Gonna go jump in this puddle of toxic, corrosive goo. Come on in, Killer Croc. The goo is fine. That sickly green glow just adds to the charm and the warmth. It's like a bathtub. Nice and lukewarm. And it's really very good for your skin. Very exfoliating. <laughs> Half ways. Anyway. Very exfoliating. Uh, very rejuvenating. It's how I keep my uh, youthful vim and vigor. It's how I can take anything Batman throws at me. How I'm ready for the next round. Anyway. And by the way, yes, that outfit is a reference to Batman the Killing Joke. Um, that Joker is wearing that outfit is a reference to Killing Joke for the long-term Batman fans. If you have not read that graphic novel, I severely suggest that you read it. It's actually very, very good. Um, despite what the author, fe how the author feels about it, um, I think it's a very good graphic novel. It's got some very good artwork by Brian Bolland. Um, and actually, I actually prefer how Brian Bolland draws his Joker, right? I think it looks the most right for a comic book Joker. It's got like the right balance between looking crazy and the, and the thinness and the skinniness and just looking devious and evil and the wild hair and oh look red brick. Anyway, um yeah we're just we've got we've got the red brick now and we've got a few other things and I guess Heath decided to wear his killing joke outfit too. Come along Heath. Jack and Heath. Time explorers and dimension travelers and dimension explorers and time travelers. I don't even know. What? I didn't make a Doctor Who reference. That wasn't even a reference to anything. Don't be silly. You are all silly. All of my fans are very silly. Anyway. Come along, Heath. Let's go. I'm gonna pull this nice uh, lever here. And again, this is really yet another level that is basically a Joker level. Um... You can really, really get everything you need without having to go too far. Um, if you need to go into the toxic goo, you can. If you need to go into the... If you need to grapple, you can. If you need to double jump, you can. It's it's very nice. So you aren't going to see a whole lot of the other group um, in this level, unfortunately. Just like... There like there was some... There, bleh, there was. There was. I know speak grammar good. Just like there were some... Aw, I wanted to knock him into the poison gas. Oh well. But anyway, just like there were some characters that I didn't get to use in the other level, and it looks like we have all the clues, so we're not too concerned about that. I think we also, it looks like we also have the Joker card, so we're not concerned about that either. Right now it's just about uh, collecting canisters, finishing that up, and I think we're just about done. And you just heard me sniffle on the recording. That was nice. I'm gonna jump up here, grabbing the blue studs as I go. Get out of here! Come join me in the goo, why don't you? The world needs more Jokers. Might as well have another. Thank you for pressing that button by mistake, Heath. <laughs> You've seen the AI kind of get confused, start running back and forth, um, and accidentally pressed the button for me. Wow. Thank you very much. Again, the pathways. Anyway, nobody needs pathways. Let's get in here. Uh, and you might notice that there is supposed to be a tightrope over on that side. Or whether there's a thing you can explode on this side. Gotta trade off one of our jokers to do that. And that will build us a nice little tightrope thing. And Huntress can walk across that. Come on, Huntress. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, Helena Wayne. Anyway, that'll bring us across to our next canister. Now we are missing only one. And I know where it is. So, it's not in here. It's, I think, in the Nexus level, and hello, post office dude! Post office dude has gone around my car, positioned outside my house. Hooray for post office dudes. 
rain, sleet, snow, or toxic chemical waste. Anyway, let's just uh, get things done. Just like last time, like last time, we're really gonna want to. Where would my partner go? Hunters, get down from there! What are you doing? Anyway, just like last time, we need to turn off the poison gas and turn on the water. Um, is we stop killing the plant and start feeding the plant. Feed me, Seymour. I don't even know that was really Audrey too, so much as almost Sean Connery-ish. I don't know what that was. It wasn't even Sean Connery. I cannot do a Sean Connery impersonation. Yeah, go figure. I can do a Joker impersonation, but not a Sean Connery persona impersonation. Just like I can do a Batman, but not a Harley. I can do Batman. Anyway, let's build this grapple thing. Again, we're gonna have to use Helena for this, because she's the only one who can do the acrobatics necessary to get up there. Well, Robin can too, but we don't really need Robin for this, do we? Yeah, figured as much. <sighs> Push this in there. Whew. Start off that and pull some levers. I don't know why I'm so tired lately. I've just been kind of bleh. Maybe I slept late too late. I guess I didn't really get much sleep until about 2 or so last night, and that's why I'm so tired. But now I feel a lot better, so let's keep going, shall we? We just need to get up here. Let's hope I don't do what I did last time. Nope. Whoops. And come on, jump. Let's hope I don't do what I did last time and fall. There we go. And now on to pulling the levers for the level. Hooray. And actually, this is the last room for villain playthrough mode. And the canister is in here somewhere. And as you can see, in about a second here, let me get rid of these guards. We are still missing one canister. So, we're going to have to look for that canister. We'll break all of Ivy's plants because I'm going to make a salad. We can have a party. It'll be spectacular. We can have it on the rooftop. Party on the rooftops of Gotham City. Because why not? Because I said so. It should be fun. We can invite Victor Zaz and we can have a grapplers only party on the rooftop. But then Batman would crash it. So that would be very good. We could have a house party at Arkham Asylum. It would be really great. I could DJ and Harley could be my, uh, my right hand, uh, Make for D for the evening, MC for the evening. Scarecrow could do the Macarena, it would be awesome. I make sense, damn it. Anyway, we are. That chute is necessary to get up where we need to go, because that's where the last canister is. Um, the last of the items, that is. So, for this, we are going to have to first break some plants and then switch over to Robin and get the Magno suit if we haven't already. Actually, I think we did already. I don't remember. My short term memory is terrible. That's all the plants down here, so let's um let's just get up to let's turn off the poison. There you go. Oh, sorry. Anyway, let's just get this poison turned off and uh, head up and get the vine uh, growing. Head up where we need to go. Water my plants, joke boy. Anyway, going to go uh, build the canister of water, of course. Who are you calling Joke Boy, Ivy? Anyway, now pull the levers. Now I got my shot forever. And now we can climb back up there. Again, provided I don't do something stupid and accidentally knock myself off of the ledge. Off of the vine or whatever, and uh, get stuck behind it like I did in the hero mode. I mean, villain mode. I mean, the hero villain mode. The villain hero mode. I'm so confused. Am I a good guy or am I a bad guy? Anyway, you can jump across that way. And this is where we need Robin. It looks like we did get his magnet suit after all. My bad. So, up we go. Of course, there's plants up here. And I believe behind one of these plants is a canister. If not, it's just kind of sitting somewhere. And actually, I think this is how you get the Joker card for this level too, if we haven't gotten it already. Jump over here, and there's our canister. Hello, canister. And we have all the canisters, and yep, we are still missing the Joker card, so we're gonna have to go searching for that. It is not on this side, however. It is up a level, but it's not on this side. We actually have to go to the other side for that. Jump across this Joker, because it's the only uh, double jumper in availability right now. Oh no! Joker, why did you do that? You overshot the jump. 
You are a silly clown. Don't be silly. Be a serious clown. Why so serious? That joke is outdated. Anyway. Now, actually, the Joker card is up here. You can see it rotating up in the upper uh, left corner there before Robin uh, uses the shoot. Go back and check if you don't, if you can't see it, um, if you didn't see it. Um, but that card is what we need to get. It's actually just sitting right out in the open. I just like breaking these plants because screw Ivy. Not literally. That'd be kind of weird and fetishy. Anyway, level complete. True villain 100%. Nice stud total. All mini kit canisters, and we unlock the Batman Dragster and Poison Ivy's card. And Gotham Street's villain with the red brick. Nicely done, if I say so myself. And after this black screen clears up, anyway, we're going to leave the Botanical Gardens for the Gotham Billion Fortress. I will see you there.